Hello, Prudential Sales Executives for our video message of the week. All right, we're going basic for this week's video message. We're going to talk about attitude. I entitled this week's message, Up Your Attitude. Now, many of you might say, well, you know what? A lot of these are review, and they are. But as always, just like affirmations, each and every day we think about this, it kind of pulls us back to center. So let's get started. First of all, waking up and ready to have a positive day. Come on, we all wake up and we're like, yeah, not so psyched for the day. Can't have that happen. You've got to wake up positive, expecting good things to happen. Next, exercise. For those of you who haven't tried this yet, <laughs> it is very, very powerful and helpful. Okay, physical exercise clears your mind and I promise you will help your attitude be as positive as it can be. All right, remember this concept what you do every day. You help people. So when you're out doing things, okay, whatever they may be to drive your business forward, remember it's always hooked to those relationships and those people who are depending on you and need your help and you help them each and every day. Next, focus on solutions, not problems. Remember the problems will continue to come and go, but it's your mindset and your attitude that consistently focuses on the solution. How do I help? How do I solve this? How do I move forward for my clients and for yourself? All right. Stay focused, envision the outcomes that you desire. Right? That keeps you in a positive mindset because you're saying, you know what, regardless of what happens at this moment in time, I'm focused on those outcomes. So stay focused on the outcomes that you're trying to accomplish. All right? Uh, little rule of thumb, no one can upset you. No situation and no person without your permission. So my advice to you to keep a positive attitude is don't give anyone permission to upset you. You control that. And if you don't think so, you're not telling yourself the truth. You do control it. So again, no permission to anybody to affect your attitude in any negative way. Stay focused on the positive. All right. Staying in a mindset of appreciation. Okay. Understanding that we are all very fortunate, okay, keeping yourself grounded to say, you know what, why am I getting so upset about a certain situation? Forget about giving them permission. Also, you know what, overall, I don't have a right to get upset. There's very important things that can happen in life. There's health issues that, you know what, are so meaningful, all right, with friends and family, the whole bit, maybe yourself. The key with it, those are real issues. But a lot of the issues we deal every day, you know what, they're just not as important as some core aspects that can happen to us in our lives. So stay in a mindset of appreciation. Ask great questions. Ask great questions that promote positive feedback and productive aspects coming out. You come up with the right questions that leads people to a very positive outcome for themselves. And of course, you get to take the ride with them. All right, next. It's our job to protect our attitudes. Remember that. So how do we do that? Well, we fill ourselves with positive books, uh, productive books, tapes, things that we can listen to that continues to knock us back into center. A lot of things can come throwing our way that we don't have control of. It's nice to take the opportunity where we do have control and fill ourselves with that positive information, positive feedback by reading and listening to great tapes. And last, but certainly not least, optimism, in my opinion, always trumps pessimism. When you're optimistic, all right, and you're thinking that, you know what, good things are going to happen, it always will win out on taking the pessimistic road. Don't think I'm saying in any way, shape, or form to ignore what's going on. It's not the point. You hear what's going on, but then you take the optimistic road and you continue to internalize that within yourself. So during the day and during your business, you pull those positive aspects, that positive attitude to help you do more and move forward. Have a great week, everybody, and we'll talk to you next week. Up your attitude. Bye-bye.